Welcome everybody to the channel. It's another day in the woods with uh, my friend Kato. Yes. Um, <clears throat> um, just saying uh, about the channel. I'm trying to be a bit more different. I'm sitting in a car. Something nice at this, this time of year. The weather's getting better. Just thought I'd get out and uh, take Kato out and sort of you can see him wandering about because I uh, one or two remarks about Cato with his uh, operation. Um, thank you very much. He was, he's fine. Just got to make sure he doesn't eat any wood. Um, could upset his stomach. Could have a major problem with that. Come on. Come on. Um, as I say, he likes to forage around. But his mace. Be careful. Come on. Come on. Come on. Good boy. Um, the main thing I've got to be careful is he doesn't eat any wood. And get into his stomach. And of course... That would be uh, not very nice for him. He would be uh, sick. So you have to keep your eye on him all the time when he's out playing in the woods, which he loves coming in the shade. It's a nice sunny day. He loves having a mooch around, but I just got to make sure that he doesn't get any wood, which is one of his favourite things. Of course, with him having a bad liver, if it gets into his stomach, he'll be um, very poorly. But anyway, folks, back to the BBC, of course, and their wisdoms and stuff. Um, thanks for all the uh, new likes on the channel and uh, reviews and some comments. And thank you very much. I'm trying to make the channel grow a bit faster. Not many, um, you know, some days it's text I get 25, 30 people watching a, a video and then another 50 or something. But as I said, it's um, basically just trying to get the channel more popularity you know if I can and, and just to tell you what you have to do on the front door which is basically very simple you know I've gone 500 videos shortly I suppose and it's all been documented there I mean the BBC have not come around knocking on my door again you know yet but I've prepared prepared as I say um, prepared for them by knowing what I have to say and when you know that, and plus, at the same time, we're not watching, we're not paying. Uh, whoever goons they are, and they come knocking on my door, means nothing to me because I'm not part of their system. I'm not got an account with the BBC, and uh, I, I don't miss it because there's so many things on YouTube, not better or worse or whatever, but there's so many things I can get into... Um, um, on YouTube, so to me, YouTube is the platform that, and one or two other things and stuff, you know, which I which I watch more than anything else. So anyway, like I said, the main thing is they're going to come to your door because once you've cancelled your license by ringing up and saying you got it two years, if it's true what they say, they're not going to come knocking for two years. You've nothing to worry about because I've documented all this on my channel. Um, come on, Kato. Uh, what happens when you become license free, like I have done over the last well, on my second year now? My my license renewal comes up in um, February 2023, so it's now May 2022. So I've got you know a few months left to go, and they've not come knocking. So. It's all being documented so that it, it proves the point that they are keeping to the word. And the best way of doing it is my, my way, by ringing up again this two-year exemption. Because the Charter, the BBC, are not going to change anything on the Charter till 2027. Or even the government are going to do something. They're not going to do anything. So... This system they've got by knocking on your door may eventually go if you the people out there know what to say. You've been coached by myself, by Inspector C and other people on YouTube what to do. You know, don't say anything. Don't sign anything really. Don't say nothing to them really. You say, no, not required license here anymore. I don't watch BBC. I'm not watching. You're not paying. So that is your main object so if that's the case then you've nothing to fear oh 
will have to come back and they'll say this to you, they'll say that to you. That's why I've got them ready, ready to film them and see what they say. And of course, you, you don't want to aggravate them anyway and try and be macho to them and just, just say, no, thank you, goodbye, be polite and shut the door. Because if you start having an argument with them, that's what they want. They want to sort of get you sort of in a way that they could get a magistrate's warrant if they wanted to because they'll give them some grief or something like that or trying to evade the situation or you know being being evasive so just say no i don't watching i'm not watching i'm not paying i'm not watching i'm not paying anymore goodbye and that's all you have to do folks if that is your plan like i've got and you're innocent because you know they're beaming this stuff out to you you don't want to watch and it's up to them to prove it the only way they can get into the house is having a search warrant so they're not going to do it folks so anyway folks thanks again for everybody tuning into the channel i hope it's useful for you um and uh if you're going to make a decision because obviously times are hard and people want to you know save some money and of course there's, there's so many other things you can watch catch up and stuff like this other channels uh like i say i watched all the snooker over the over the um bank holiday weekend i watched it all on eurosport and our friends out i went to a friend's house to watch some of the final and stuff so i never miss anything that was on the bbc if there was a particular something on the bbc if it's any good and i mean good programs will come either to netflix because they sell them all to somebody else so you, you'll come across things like i say i was w watching about the jimmy savile case the actual Jimmy Savile um, situation, how the BBC and the, the inspector, um, just trying to remember his name now, the investigator, um, the the person who actually investigated Jimmy Savile was very very good. He's on YouTube. When he's on, he's got his next, he's got his Netflix channel, which I'm I'm going to review that because I've, I've you know I stopped paying the license fee because of what the, the Savile did and everything else and of course what they did to Club Richard of course anyway folks I'm going to um, wind it up here and um, see you in the next one and like I say get prepared get prepared for your um, encounters with the BBC of course if you do that like I've told you you'll have no problem you just shut the door and you've, you've nothing to fear just be prepared I'll have to watch him now because he's gone into the undergrowth here now I'm more afraid he's crafty. He wants to get some bloody wood in his mouth. Kato, stop it. No, stop it. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Anyway, folks, um, we'll uh, get back to you on the next one. And uh, hope it's some help to people. That's what it's all about. This channel's just there to, to try and help you how to stop the knocking on the door, how to, you know, how to stop them just, you know, doing it you know so if nobody's everybody knows what the score is they'll stop doing the door-to-door -door sales anyway folks thanks again everyone subscribed and i'll see you in the next one bye now